I think this will change the way we park. What we learn, it will be very useful to society. The goal of the project is to determine empty parking spots along the highway or in a parking structure to provide information to the individuals looking for parking spots so they can drive directly to the spot rather than having to search for one. We want to solve this problem using the technology in the market, not something like 20 years or 30 years in the future. So the system is based on using uh, intelligent vehicles that can sense the environment. At this point in time, the auto manufacturers are putting these sensors on the high-end cars. Uh, there are sensors that detect whether you are going to get too close to a car next to you, so they beep and let you know that you, you should be aware and use that to see if we can find empty spots. While we are driving the six radars, they're scanning the environment. And we try to drive at five miles per hour because this will give us a very constant reading of from the radars. All this information is being sent to a computer which is in the back seat of the car, behind the back seat of the car. The information in the car is processed very quickly. As soon as a car passes an empty parking spot, it detects it immediately sends it through wireless communication to the local infrastructure and from there, within a couple of seconds, having passed the parking spot, the users would have the information. I've always been interested in reducing pollution. It will reduce the traffic in the sense that people would go directly to the spot that they have identified. And if that is full, they would look in the app and find the next nearest one. Anything you do to reduce travel time is a plus. Of course, there are challenging parties like sometimes there are more than one reflection from one car. The environment has lots of noise, like pedestrians, like trees, like the curb, all will have uh, the noise in the background. So how can you distinguish the car and the environment is another challenging problem we have. What we're looking for is a very highly accurate methodology that will pick out, make very few errors in selecting the empty spots. Our hope is that within the next year and a half, we will have a pilot program running within Ann Arbor. We are not producing devices, we are not designing cars, we are taking information and then processing it and passing it on. That's what industrial engineers do best. And then flew to Dallas, and the pilot got off and a new pilot got on, and she flew the plane to Detroit. All these pieces are interconnecting. If it's icy in Atlanta and that plane doesn't make it to Dallas,